Now, Russia has launched attacks on Ukrainian military positions across multiple fronts, while Ukraine continues to repel Moscow's relentless offensives. A report by Russia's defense ministry says that its forces conducted strikes on at least five Ukrainian cities. Russian tactical aviation missile units and artillery also carried out attacks on Ukrainian military units and ammunition depots. Meanwhile, as rescuers scrambled to remove mountains of rubble from Ukraine's historic city of Chernihiv, officials said that the death toll in the city after a Russian airstrike climbed to 18, while another 78 were wounded when three missiles slammed into the city center. The visuals on your screens were captured by an eyewitness. They show the moment when a large explosion struck the city. Panicking residents then attempted to take cover from the strike at a bus stop. Another body cam footage released by the National Police of Ukraine showed a police personnel rushing to provide medical aid from the attack. Zelensky blamed Russia for the attack but also said that the West should do more to help defend Ukraine's skies. Meanwhile, in Washington, Biden has applauded the planned vote in Congress on the massive new Ukraine aid package. POTUS has called on American lawmakers to pass it immediately. The images from these attacks are, are horrifying, but it also, Alex, beyond uh, uh, to take a step back from the immediate, it underscores <coughs> the, the need of passing the National Security Supplemental. Um, our support for our Ukrainian partners, we believe, can continue to make a difference in this conflict. It can save lives, uh, but the, the, the House of Representatives needs to act now. Now, Chernihiv lies around 145 kilometers north of Ukraine's capital, Kiev, and had a pre-war population of around 285,000 people. The city was badly damaged when Russian tanks swept into Ukraine from Belarusian territory in February of 2022 and besieged the city until April of that year. For all the latest news, download the Vion app and subscribe to our YouTube channel.